The stop do not stack on top of, and they crushed it. See the shattered glass. I, it just is not supposed to look like this at all. Good morning. Rich and I are on the homestead today. It's a beautiful day. It's 12 degrees. We're just getting some more propane to get the heat going in the camper. We are waiting for our solar delivery today, the lithium iron phosphate battery delivery today. It's gonna be a good day. Welcome to our channel. I'm Kathy and that's Rich and we are living off grid in the Adirondacks of New York State while building a homestead from scratch on 135 acres so we can live a simpler life of freedom and sustainability. All the mud that we were dealing with the other day is solid as a rock. That's how cold it is. 12 degrees. Well, it's going on one o'clock and nobody has showed up yet. And you can see, even though it's still really cold out, it's about 28 degrees in this clearing because it gets so much sun, it's very warm and everything has turned into a muddy, muddy mess again. We're waiting on the solar. It's coming on a tractor trailer and we had requested a box truck. So he is going to take a look at the road and see if he can get up there. It's a little muddy and we might have to come down with the tractor and, and, and carry it up, we'll find out. So, I'm just waiting on him now. Should be coming from down there somewhere. All right, here he is. Hell, hop in the car, we'll drive up, okay. and if you want, we can walk down, we can walk. All right, so the first delivery is here. Yes. <laughs> and? It's on a tractor trailer with a single axle, and it's very muddy here, so he says he's gonna pack up the driveway, and I'm gonna unload him with the tractor and the forks. But it wasn't supposed to be a tractor trailer. It literally no. says on the paperwork, that it was supposed to be a box truck because we, this was exactly our concern. We spent time on the phone, we made all the arrangements. <laughs> it even says it on his paperwork that it's a straight box truck, but for some reason they show up with a tractor trailer. Yep. So. Well, looks like he's on his way. Hey, do you want to lose that pallet? We'll take it. Yeah, definitely. got three of those rail boxes. Yeah. They look like they're fine. They have the same part number on all of them. Okay. Yeah. Oh, here's another truck coming in. Truck number two. Usually the way it happens, right? Oh my gosh. All at once. What are you gonna do? So yeah, there was a, a do not stack box here. Yep. Somebody took it off. And I guess we'll just sign and then check it if there's anything yeah, missing. Just right to be inspected late. Yeah. That covers you for everything. So what they do is they put this here and they say stop, do not stack on top of, and they crushed it. So we're gonna check these panels. That's gonna take a little while. We got how many pallets? Three pallets and three long boxes. Yeah. Well, that was fun. We just got our full delivery. Richie was a pro. That tractor has been completely. That's all it could lift because it was so far out on the forks. But how yeah. lucky we are that we have it though. I yeah. mean, honestly, 
because when you receive a delivery from Unbound Solar of a kit or anything, you have to be prepared. They have like this entire list of things on four easy steps to ensure efficient freight delivery. We had our invoice available. We were ready to receive the shipment. Richie had the tractor. And just an FYI, look, it shows right here on a straight truck. Literally says it on the invoice. All right, we did plan ahead. We knew exactly where we were going to unload it and where we were going to store it. So now we're gonna unbox and we're really gonna check everything closely because they literally give you, I think 48 hours. Oh, 24 here. I thought it was 48, it says 24 here. So the first box that we're gonna look at is the solar panels. Um, well, there should be 20 Helene 320 watt solar panels and nothing is supposed to be stacked on top but you can see that the little thing on top that says don't stack anything on top is literally crushed. So we found damage already in two spots. How can I show that this is like dented? I mean, like will the glass have the functionality of the panel? Probably not. Nah, it won't. Let's tilt it towards, towards the camera. It, oh, everyone has a little cardboard yeah. corner. Just do like this for a minute. Jesus. I don't even know if that's shattered. That does look shattered. Totally shattered. Oh, it's bad. Look at it. It's totally shattered. Totally and completely shattered. And I just got glass in my finger. Crap. Ow. Yeah, look at all the broken glass here. Oh my God. All right. The first panel is completely shattered. No good. You can see the shattered glass. Yeah. Uh, it just is not supposed to look like this at all. This is the glass. Shards. Yeah. Everywhere from the first panel. Yeah, look. Yeah. Glass shards everywhere. That'll hurt. Yeah, not acceptable. Is that what you got in your finger? Yeah, that's exactly what I have in my finger, and my finger is still bleeding. All right, so what do we do now? Do you have a vacuum? When you spend as much money as we did, I just really expect everything to be. That's right, I don't want to see a scratch. In good condition. That's a scratch. Scratches in a couple of places, definitely. This will not come off. Um, that's not acceptable. This is the one that had all the white stuff from the shattering of that one. So this solar panel is definitely no good either. That's literally the first two panels we looked at that are no good. This one looks fine. Yeah, there's just a little uh, wear marks on the, court, on the edges but it doesn't look broken. Nope, and it doesn't have scratches. Look at this though. Well, if you can see that, that's dented, scratched, gouged. And then on the same side of the same panel, different side of the same no, panel? No, yeah, right here, which was the second to the bottom panel. Right, that one Just also scratches. Was, was all. So something happened. All it right. should have been packed better. Or treated better. One or two. All right, we just finished. Two panels are no good, they have to go back. And we have a couple panels that are scratched and dinged. I don't know if it means anything, but we took pictures because we have to report it. See how dented this is too. Yeah. Right? And the whole little thing on top was crushed. They should have put some foam or something in here. Yeah. On Not to the next happy. pallet. They put in some generator cables for the connectors, but the generator is not part of this delivery. So it should be everything except the generator and the batteries, which we also got at a separate delivery. So maybe the generator's coming in another delivery. We're gonna have to reach out to them. Book. It came with directions. Good. Look at that. That's a fancy-looking book. 
Yep. Kathy, you're going to have to help me read that. Mm. All right, so that is the inverter, the big controller for everything. That's all that's in here. Ten. All right, ten. Ten, ten of these rails. So these. four in two boxes, that's eight. And then two in this box. See, this one is two. Can you see it? Yep, perfect. Okay, we have one more crate to go through. This is crushed, like yep. something hit it. Yep. This is crushed, like something hit that. Or was on top of it. There's a lot of little things. It sounds like I heard a bunch of little hardware jingling around in there. Let me just call out what's in each box and then you check it off. Monster battery cables. Two Heiko, does it have a brand name on it? No brand, no name. That. It says male and female on the invoice, but this is missing an end. Doesn't, can't find it. It's a polyvoltaic cable. So that's gonna be a problem. I don't know what it is. Is it an unlocking tool, a cable clip? Oh, it's an iron ridge. Okay, that helps. Again, not Done. It only took us about two hours at least. I don't even know. I lost track about of time. About two hours. Definitely check through everything. We found a couple of small problems mm -hmm. that we do need to email. I already called about the solar panels. They gave me an email address, so I have to email them pictures and they'll get back to me tomorrow, I was told. A lot of the things weren't labeled and we kind of had to do process of yeah, elimination. Yeah, it was a little hard to figure out. And, uh, you know, other than the two solar panels that were damaged, one wire is missing a mail in. We don't know if it's even supposed to be on there. It's supposed to be on there. Okay, it's supposed to be on there. We're just missing the generator. The only thing on the order, it's completely paid for. Nobody told us it wasn't going to be part of the order. I specifically emailed Unbound Solar to make sure that everything was going to be in this order. Never got a response. They never responded to so me. So as far as we know, we don't know when or uh, if right. this generator is coming. But it definitely was not on that shipping label. No. Um, so it was not meant to be part of the shipment. Again, we also didn't know, they did not inform us, the batteries were coming in a separate shipment. One booklet. Mounting hardware. This is what I was looking for. Communication, uh, I forget what it's called, but yeah, it comes with these. So they can talk to each other. Wow. There it is. There's a switch to turn it on, but I think I'm going to read the directions. This must be where the two wires connect. Wow. So far, so good. I just expected everything to be on one truck, one and done. And it's been two trucks so far, and it's going to be a third because we need to get generator. a generator. And now we need to figure out how to get two other solar panels, get the two solar panels replaced. Um, yeah, that's probably, I would imagine, going to be the hardest thing. Yeah. I'm um, a well, fortune teller. <laughs> uh, it would be nice to have some kind of tracking on the generator. Uh, yeah. Just know where that is. We'll, we'll be reaching out and finding out, and we'll keep you updated uh, on this entire kit. And we'll also update you with respect to what everything costs. I don't have it in front of me right now. I didn't even bring it today. Um, but we'll do a video of that pretty soon, sharing the cost of everything. Because this was a big um, expense, but we had a lot of good reasons for doing it. Anything else? I think that's it. Thanks for joining us. Uh, Unbound Solar Solar System Kit Delivery and check. It's done. And that's it. Now nothing to it but to put it all together now. <laughs> <laughs> all 
All right, so thanks for watching. I'm Rich. And I'm Kathy. And we are creating a simpler life in the Adirondacks.